Well, the arts community in Kentuckyana is right up there with bourbon and horse racing as far as importance. And for many years now, it's been a top priority at the Fund for the Arts to provide kids access to the arts. Right now, they're providing more than 400,000 educational experiences for children in our region each year. And that's not enough. And that's why former Councilwoman Barbara Sexton Smith and the Fund for the Arts recently established a new education and enhancement fund. Barbara joins us now via StreamYard to explain what this endowment fund is and what it will provide. Barbara, first of all, can you tell us what, what is the endowment fund? Well, an endowment fund is a way to invest in our future for generations to come. And it's a very easy way to raise money that guarantees that the programming that you deliver today will be there for your grandchildren, their grandchildren, and so on. So what we're doing is we are running a campaign to raise $100,000 and that $100,000 will be invested. And it is the interest earned off of that each year that will pay for arts programming in one elementary school for every child in that school for the entire year. And it is so exciting. So my pledge to the community, because I love this community and I believe in our children today and tomorrow and forever, I have set up an arrangement to match the first $35,000 raised. So once we hit 35,000, there's the match. We're at a total of 70 and we only have 30,000 to go. So I'm on here with you all today inviting everyone in this community, please join me again. Let's do this together. No gift is too small, no gift is too large. You wanna do something for kids today in the classroom that makes their lives better tomorrow. All you gotta do is call the Fund for the Arts or go online to the Fund for the Arts, or you can call me directly. Half of y'all in this county have my telephone number. <laughs> and you are, and I love to pick up the phone. You can tell I yes. stay on it all the time. And let's do this together. Whether you want to give $10, $25, $100, $10,000, we'll take it and we'll do it together. Barbara, I just, everybody loves your passion uh, about this specific topic. You know, the former CEO and president of Fund for the Arts, you're just so passionate about arts in this community. Why is it so important uh, to make sure that arts are, are, are accessible to all children in our schools? It's critically important for the child's experience in the classroom. Research has proven throughout the years that if you use arts in the math class, use arts in the science or the history class, and the English classes, children will retain that knowledge better, and then they score better on their test. More importantly, from why I'm doing this, the children feel better about themselves. They have more self-esteem, more self-confidence. Then they want to get up and go to school. We have proven that the attendance rates go up, the academic achievement goes up, and the graduation rates go up. Y'all, we can do this. I spent half of my life in fundraising for the Fund for the Arts and the Metro United Way. I think everybody knows that. So now in my rewirement mode, after I left Metro Council, I wanted to do something very significant. That's what the magic of an endowment fund is. And after we were able to raise this first $100,000, my goal is we raise another 100,000, invest it. And every time we do that, one more school, every child in that school gets to have guaranteed live arts experiences. We've already been doing this at Roosevelt Perry and at Bick Elementary, Lincoln Performing Arts School, Coleridge Taylor. And just this year, we gave an award to J.B. Atkinson. So let's do this, you all. Okay, you've got us fired up now, Barbara. How can we give? Okay, it's real simple. You can go online, fund for the arts, Dot org or call the fund for the arts 582 0100 and yes you guys can call me dial this telephone right here 5514689 yes i just gave my personal cell phone number on live television because that's what's so important to me about doing this barbara and thank you do, so much and we're going to tell everybody barbara's on the phone right now and she's ready to take your <laughs> call calls. and if you're not excited uh, to give to the fund for the arts i don't know but i think people are going to start calling in to make a contribution thank you barbara to the fund for the arts in support of barbara sexton smith education enhancement fund Call 5 at 2 or visit funfortheartsorg give.